November 23rd marks a very special day in history for math lovers all over the world, and it's known as Fibonacci Day. Fibonacci Day celebrates the discovery made by mathematician Leonardo Bonacchio, also known as Leonardo Fibonacci. He discovered a sequence where the sum of one number is created by the two numbers before it. One famous Fibonacci sequence is 1123, and that's why 1123 was chosen for this holiday. Let's go ask some teachers to see how they celebrate Fibonacci Day. You know what the Fibonacci sequence is? Yeah, I do. Could you tell us a little bit about it? Uh, the Fibonacci sequence is, uh, I believe, 1, 1, 2, 3, 5, 8, 13. It adds the previous numbers to get the next number. Basically, you're taking the pre the to get the next digit in a sequence, you add the two previous di digits. Mm -hmm. So it would start out one, then one, and then you add one and one to get two, and then you add one and two to get three, then you add two and three to get five, and three and five to get eight, and so on. Is there any way you're going to celebrate Fibonacci Day? <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> I'll <laughs> celebrate it as Thanksgiving. Um, now it's the first I've heard about Fibonacci Day. You know, I've heard of Pi Day and other days, but Fibonacci Day, it's something new to me. So well, I, now you know. Now I know. Maybe I will celebrate it. We shall see. <laughs> well, I think that's Thanksgiving. As I think it's also Thanksgiving if I look at my calendar, but I think it is. So I'll be thankful for Fibonacci and, um, yeah, definitely celebrate. So there you have it, a brand new holiday to celebrate in the month of November. And remember to be thankful for Leonardo Fibonacci and his contributions to math all over the world. Now back to you, Laker Update.